Good afternoon, everybody. This is Chris at Classic Cars of Palm Beach. Uh, we're going to be doing a walk around video on this uh, 2017 Mazda MX-5 Miata RF. Um, really nice looking car, as you can see. Great color. It's almost like a gray pearl. Uh, really, really shines. Really a nice color. Uh, anyway, let me tell you about the point of these videos is to point out any flaws on the car. This is pretty much for out-of-state buyers that aren't going to see the car in person until they receive it. We do a lot of that kind of business because of our reviews online. Um, so we ship out a lot of cars and we want to make sure we give a perfect description so that nobody gets a surprise when the vehicle gets to them. Uh, we don't like surprises. So we point out nicks, scratches, dings, curb rash on the wheels, uh, you know, excess wear and tear on the interior. Uh, so I kind of walk around these things before I do the video so that I get a good look at them and, and everything. And uh, this car is almost perfect, uh, but uh, we're going to go over here. So there we go. Obviously, we're on the passenger side front. In the front, you know, that's really where most of your damage is on cars that you look at because, you know, you get little stone chips or nicks or any some bug damage. Uh, this car is really pretty much flawless. Uh, a couple little stone chip size I mean like not even pin head size tip of the pen like a couple of those right there but nothing that's gonna take away from the looks of the car because it's nothing you can see unless you get right up on top of it okay hood's really nice okay coming around here we're gonna look at this wheel for a curb rash I do not see any on it Right, and tire condition is brand new. That's like a brand new tire on the front driver's side there. So we'll come down the side of the car looking for dents, dings, or scratches. We'll see anything. Let's go right up to the convertible roof here. Right. Top's in great condition. And by the way, if you see something that I don't see, like in the video that I don't mention, it's typically because it's uh, it's some kind of a dirt dirt or something like that that's gonna, just going to come off like that right there. It looks like a little spot, but it's not. It's just a little dirt. Okay. Rear side passenger wheel. I mean, driver's side wheel. No curb rash. Okay, we'll come around the back. A little scratch there in the paint. Okay. Right there. A little mark in the paint. A little scratch. I don't know if that's going to come out. Oh, wait, that is. No, no that's not going to come out little teeny scratch very short very narrow scratch can be filled in with touch no problem we're on the back of the car I don't see any damages on the back now the passenger side rear passenger side wheel don't see any curb rash on it Another, another little hairline scratch. I've never seen these scratches. They're so thin, they're really nothing to them. So buffing the car may fill that. Because, I mean, I can't feel it with my nail. And it's very, very, very thin. Almost like somebody had a needle or something scratched along it for a little bit. But it's not deep, and it's, uh, it won't be hard to touch up. So I don't see anything else on this passenger side. Everything looks great. So we'll go to the interior here. Pretty much just a flawless car on the outside. Okay, look for excess. You know what I look for is on these door panels, on the armrests and stuff, any excess wear and tear, but that's all great condition. I don't see any wear and tear on the bolster of the seat where you get in and out of it. So everything is perfect on this interior package. All the gauges are clear. Everything is in real nice shape. Shifter, no excess wear and tear on that. So, yep, everything's pretty much uh, perfect on this car. A couple of hair scratches on there, very minor. Um, if you have any questions about anything that I did not cover, please give us a call. Thank you.